Okay. Uh, so I have the. Okay, children. <laughs> I have the lemon boysenberry uh, funnel cake here, which is like the last thing we have to try, except for the popcorn chicken, which I'm not gonna try because I hate everything from Simply on a Stick. Sorry, personal preference. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's got the funnel cake, the whipped cream. There's boysenberry jam. Oh no, that's actually got the lemon in it. Okay, so boysenberry lemon topping, like sundae topping, and then there's lemon zest, and you can get it with ice cream, you do not have to get it with ice cream. We just get it with ice cream every time we do it, because it looks a lot cooler with the ice cream when we film it. So, uh, let me see if I can try some of this. I need a knife. tried this uh, before now because every time we went the line was <laughs> really long and uh, it wasn't moving but it's so busy here today that every other line is super long for all of the boysenberry stuff uh, but the, the line for the funnel cake was only like 15 people long so anyway I did with the Dole Whip where this mostly tastes like lemon <laughs> or I guess more importantly I'm having the same problem I had with the hummus where this mostly tastes like lemon and I'm not getting a lot of boysenberry like there are whole boysenberries in this topping but I think unless you have one of these you're not gonna get a really strong boysenberry flavor you're mostly gonna get lemon like yeah that's a lot of like the boysenberry like tartness along with the tartness of the lemon but this actual topping bit it just kind of tastes like lemon yeah it tastes like a lemon meringue pie <laughs> and that's all it is um the the funnel cake itself is a lot less crunchy than some of the ones we've had um and in general i think the ones at uh the funnel cake we're over by boardwalk barbecue and the log ride uh, this funnel cake place, theirs tend to be slightly more undercooked because they make more of them and I think the fryer at the Ghost Town Grub is set higher so that they can turn theirs out faster. Yeah, it's a little, what I'm saying is there's a little bit of difference depending on where you get your funnel cake from. So if you like a slightly undercooked funnel cake, I would say if the line's not super long, I would come to the one by the log ride. Um, Overall, I don't think this is necessarily super different from the regular boysenberry funnel cake that you can get, and uh, the ice cream is melting, so I have to finish this review up, but, like, if you want something kind of different and you're here all the time, maybe get this, but other than that, it's just the regular boysenberry one, but now it's got lemon in it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to finish this, and I will see you in the next one. I don't want to like melt off on the plane.